We are eating vegetarian kimchi bokbap. I didn't make it today, Tash made it. She's very good at making Korean dishes. I'm not good at making Korean dishes. I'm better at making Western dishes. So, this is our last vegetarian meal. I think we should have more explored vegetarian food places. Mm, we really didn't do that enough. Another vegetarian place in Hongdae. It's called Seoul Bowl. I think it's a vegan place. Alright, let's go in. Oops. They have to turn out. Hey guys! So I came to this vegan cafe. Oh my god. It's located in Gangnam Station, so it's not honestly that close to the station. Like, they look like the uphill is just crazy here, but, anyways. So, um, there are actually not many vegan places in Gangnam, but this is the one, it's called Tima, which is like killed this thing. Oops, oops. Okay, we gotta have some cauliflower. I love cauliflower, but can't really find it in Korea. So, their food is pretty healthy, but they don't sell a coffee here. I just said, like, I want to quit because <laughs> I'm always farting. <laughs> like, always, like. Man, like, it's ridiculous. And I have no energy, man. <laughs> like, I need to like, like half no my energy to fart. <laughs> know, half my energy is spent on farting, and then the other half is spent on pooing. So <laughs> the poo is not that much. Like I'm going to poo. Uh, like literally, <laughs> I'm going to poo, and then I'll still fart after that. Like how is that possible? I just pooed. And I have finished, it doesn't come out anymore, but I still feel like, dang, I need to poo. Just, it's just not a yeah. fun experience, it's less like, <laughs> look, you know, I've, I've, I looked at some YouTube stuff and people were saying, oh, you're just detoxing. Like, <laughs> man. Oh man, like, I used to poo just like, once in a maybe two days, right? Like, I had kind of a little bit of constipation, but um, now I poo like, like, at least once in a day, sometimes Highs, yeah, I just put like three times a day. That crap is freaking huge. It's just not good. And like, like, you know, doing this vegetarian challenge with yoga is so tough because I constantly have gas in my tummy. And you know, when you go to yoga, you do all these yeah. like poses and your fart is coming out and you have, you gotta hold the fart and you gotta like, you know, tense and do all these yoga poses. Yep. I kind of lost my appetite because it's not that yum anymore. <laughs> and like, obviously, I will start eating less food because it's not as delicious, literally. But the thing is, right, like, you know, we're not eating that much and we're pooing so much. So it means that, like, <laughs> when, you were on, when you were on a meat diet, like, you must have stored so much poo. Our chow mein is going crazy. Huh? And Dawn is cooking. And look at them, look at the smoke. Oh. It's like a barbecue inside the house. Mm. You guys have no hope oh. of delicious in this thing. Mm. Ah. <laughs>
Schokolade, jetzt auf den Hof. Da! Der Arme, decent cook, man. Hey guys. Sunday. 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 Ciao, darling. Today is last vegetarian Sunday. We always wanted to try that um, Karu Skills salad place, remember? Oh, yeah. And maybe that. we should try it today. Salad bowl? Yeah, the salad yeah, bowl. Yeah, close on Sundays. A different one called Bad Farmers. We can go there. Okay. We were thinking what to do for our next challenge. Jonathan keeps saying he wants to do boxing. I want to do boxing. On meat every day. But boxing, why challenge. boxing? Meat only challenge? That will, that will lock up your skin and everything, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, I will feel really terrible, I think, if I do that. Don't you think so? Yeah, I'd be shit. Yeah, it would be really bad. So I was looking for the vegetarian brushes. This brand is called Dailing Tools, so they sent me this brush set. Um, and they have lots of vegetarian brushes. I used already two of these brushes and I definitely love them. Especially... This one, what is it called? I don't know why I'm not reviewing this plastic ceiling, but um, it's uh, it's 956 Lented Precious Kabuki. It really does not feel like synthetic at all. It's super soft. And I really love how it feels like on my skin and it just blends the makeup really smoothly. How is it even synthetic? I don't get it. Thank you guys for sending me this. And the price is actually not that expensive. I expected the price to be way higher than this. I think it was, I can't remember. I'll put it over here. I haven't tried those eye brushes yet, um, but I definitely love this too. That a really nice color match today. Is it? Yeah. Thank you. I really like it. Oh, very nice. Very good. Have you ever put butter and then put it in the toaster? But it you makes the toaster very dirty. How do you wipe inside the toaster? Do you reckon I can hit my head on the roof? Yeah, try. Easy. <laughs> nah, you do. Come on, do it. Again. I can easily do it. I'm just gonna make a hole in this. Let's say make it. We'll huh? renovate it. Come on. No, I don't want to make a hole in this. You're not gonna make a hole. Come on, do it. Uh, that's that's cheating because that's lower. Ow! <laughs> so we can make our own garlic bread by just like chopping garlic, putting butter, put it in the toaster, make some garlic bread, y'all. Then why don't you make it, y'all? Because I can't bother right now, y'all. So I ordered jalapeno cheeseburger and Jonah ordered... I got a double cheeseburger. I haven't had a cheeseburger in ages. Uh, but I don't think this is going to be the same as a normal cheeseburger. Interesting. How's the fries? Mm. Jalapeno. Oh, it's juicy. Mm. Oh, you got a hash brown? We're doing like outdoor barbecue here. This smells is amazing. This, this smells so good. It smells like shashlik. I want some of them so much. Oh man. Oh my so god. Good. No, we gotta leave this place. Last vegetarian day. Having some breakfast. What's for breakfast, down? With Bix. Almond milk. Hemp seed. And banana. Today, I am just making a bean meat patty. Kongbogi. Like, I'm just done eating the same thing every day, so... I'm boiling, what is it called? Kidney bean? And kidney bean and a little bit of chickpea. This is walnut and cashew nut powder. Oh my god, guys, it smells like peanut butter. Ah, 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 ah. 
It was not easy. Really, really not easy. Yeah, so it's a new part of it. Ooh, look at this egg. It looks so, <laughs> it's so weird. Delicious. It's so delicious. Mm. That is sucks. Our last vegetarian home cooked meal for this challenge. Probably will be doing more. Make that egg. You filming? Hi guys, we are at the Sangsu. At the Sangsu? Sangsu. This looks like pretty cool street, like drinking street. Yeah. Oh, this is my favorite song. I don't know what it's called. I don't know the lyrics. So this place is called Sangsu. They have really nice, cool vibe Tell me if here. A car yeah, there is no car coming. So there, we are we are heading to a place called Slunch Factory and they do vegetarian and also non-vegetarian and also vegan food as well so it's like pretty mixed but seems like they have really delicious menu compared to other vegetarian or vegan places so i was actually very keen to go there already pretty long time ago but um Hongdae, like songs area is pretty far from us so didn't really get a chance to do it but now and this is our last vegetarian uh, last meal as vegetarians so let it go oh, let's go and get it go are we going to continue this after like flexitarian yeah i'll be doing flexitarian maybe we'll be having like one one meal per day right we'll be doing like vegetarian not really sure can't really promise that but i'll try to keep being vegetarian let me check the isn't that one? Looks like. Here it is. Is it meat? We just passed by looking at here. Look at the menu. So they've got Australian beef. The vegetarian. What's a what's a polo vegetarian? I'm happy to be polo vegetarian. Only chicken, but no beef. I'm happy to be polo vegetarian. Mushroom soy milk cream risotto. That's weird, man. We have to have this. Eggplant and spinach pasta. Oh, this is pasco. Yeah. Really? There's this one. A pollock row, but then it's got. No, it's not vegetarian, this is. Okay guys, now we're gonna enjoy our last supper. Hope you guys enjoyed our journey be trying to be as healthy eaters and next month I'll see you guys with a new challenge. Bye!
Okay, the food was amazing. I think this is literally, this is definitely the best vegetarian restaurant I ever tried. And also it's really nice how they tell you, guide you through the vegetarian, like the levels of the vegetarians. It's really nice, especially for people who never experienced it. So it'll be really good to know, right? So um, hopefully you guys enjoyed all my journey and I'll see you again next week. Bye-bye. Thanks for you know, being with me. I love you. <laughs>